Happy Halloween, everybody! It's me, Mr. Pumpkin, the mayor of Halloween World! <laughs> Guys, it's the Halloween vlog, be ba da ba da do. It is currently, what is it? Hold on a second. La -da -da -dee 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 -dee. It is 11.43, the night before Halloween. La -da -da. I am so excited, partially sad. I mean, I'm a lot of emotion right now, but you guys are here for the 2024 Halloween vlog. It's going to be fun. Um, what I wanted to do tonight, you're like, why are you filming it the day or the night before Halloween? Because we got to get the tricks or treats ready for the little monsters. Usually I do it the day of, like last minute I'm putting the treat bags together, but you know what? We're on top of things this year, baby. Don't I look good in a mask? I feel like masquerade masks are a really sexy thing on me. I don't get it, but I feel like I'm sexy in a mask. What do you think? How do I look? See, it's a fitting look for me. Oh, dang it. I, I forgot to use this little pumpkin wand in the intro. I was gonna go, it's me, Mr. Pumpkin, happy Halloween, Ooh. But I forgot to use it. Just pretend I didn't, oh my God, that's scary. Ugh. They had a lot of great candy at Target and they had some pretty good decorations. Target gets a B plus this Halloween season. So um, I went there tonight, we got some more candy. We got, oh, we got the mummy, cotton candy we've got i kind of want to keep this stuff for myself screw the trick-or-treaters this little potion fizz stuff oh my god look at the artwork isn't that fun isn't that fun that's fun what do we got here oh so this is great look at this they're they're little fingers they're little gummy fingers and then you dip them in the potion and you suck on the finger to like eat the pop rocks good lord frankenstein's a fat bitch in this artwork Gummy crawly worms. Oh, the spooky crawly worms. Look at these guys. These are Dracula's filled candy straws. What does that even mean? You guys want to know what a dork I am? I don't want to ruin the packaging. I'm going to save the packaging until I'm in my 80s. And then I'll die and it'll get thrown away. Somebody's got to do it. Oh, what's going on here? These are cute. I love the art. These are good. What the heck, Dracula? Ah! Boop. Okay, listen, listen. The, the living room floor was way too uncomfortable. Uh, I'm not sitting on the living floor for an hour to put trick-or-treat bags together. We're gonna do it on my bed. But first, boom! Maison Martin Margiela sneakers. These are amazing. Um, I call these my pumpkin boots. These are my pumpkin boots. Pumpkin sneakers. Very expensive, but very amazing. Maison Margiela, you know what you're doing. I have like six pairs of these in different material. Like patent leather and leather. Anyways, I just wanted to give a shout out to my pumpkin boots. Maybe I'll wear these tomorrow. I don't know. All right. We got to get to work. I got doubles of a lot of these bags, but there's, there's a lot of work to do here. Hey, by the way. Oh, baby, baby. We got some Halloween themed sneakers over here. These are Golden Goose. Francie models. Really cool. High tops. Look at all this really cool packaging. The little worms. These are the little monster fingers that you dip in the pop rocks. See the little potion? It's a little packet with a potion on it that you dip the wing. The little monster fingers. They got these little monster car wheels. These are like fruit by the foot, I think. But look at that. Two different designs. These little potion packs of the fun dip. Different colors with this and the little the little the little rings, candy rings. The Cotton candy or candy floss if you're British. I like how they have different mummy hand poses for each flavor. Um, so yeah, everything's everything's unbagged and I, I just wanted to show you. Okay, I'm about to go to bed, but I've got all the candy bags lined up on the table. And these are all the ones that are like full of all the goodness. And then over here in the sink, we've got some that are like less full. These are for the kids that show up late. These are the ones that insult me by showing up late. I gotta go to bed. Good night. 
sleep tight, don't let the ghouls bite. Unless you're into that kind of thing, then go wild. Oh, happy Halloween morning, everybody. It's a gloomy, cold day. It's kind of windy. This is gonna be a great Halloween. We are gonna go run really quick to the Dollar Tree to get about 15 candy bars just to be on the safe side. I don't wanna get anything that looks tropical. Where's like good Halloween looking stuff? These might work. These are very 90s. It's very retro. Check it out. I got one final 2024 Mountain Dew Voodoo. Look at that. Look at that design. That's pretty good design. <laughs> Are you Taylor Swift? Well, well, well. Look what we got here. It's Halloween. Oh my God. Did you already get candy next door? No, you're our first staff. Look at the Ninja Turtle. Nick's stealing candy and he's too old to get trick or treat candy. I am not, candy. I said trick or treat. You didn't even, didn't even say trick or treat. Yeah, here's a treat. Here is my setup. It's pretty spooky out here. It's gonna look better when it gets dark because I'm gonna put candles in these jack-o'-lanterns on the sides. Oh, the trick or treaters are coming. Here they come! You guys, this is like the most successful trick-or-treat night we have had so far. We are only 30 minutes in, and we've had like 35 people. I am buzzing with excitement. This guy is my favorite animatronic that my parents have. But as you can see, he's a little, he's a little tattered, which just, you know, it just makes him scarier. Look at that. Look at this cute little setup in front of my parents' house. I gave them this fence with the ghost and cat. Why are you, she's telling me you're smoking over here. Look at all the trick-or-treaters over there. It's only like 5.30. It's getting darker out. The spirits are about to come out full swing. Just wanted to give you guys a quick look at my, ignore the noises happening back there. Here's a quick look at my Halloween Riz, baby. Ba 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 ba. I'm gonna hit you with one of these. Ha Ho ho. Can't believe I almost forgot to not put the, I almost didn't put the mask on. How could I be Mr. Pumpkin, or whatever I called myself at the beginning of this vlog, without the mask? <laughs> Ooh, look at this. What do we got in here? Sadie! <laughs> Hi girls! Sadie! A lot of people said we come to your house first all the time. Really? What is this? I'm a scarecrow, keep up. Dead end. Oh, okay. <laughs> then why are you moving if you're a scarecrow? <laughs> Ooh, look at that spooky Halloween sunset. Let's walk over to my aunt's house. Let's just go bother her for no reason right now. Uh-oh. This guy blew up in the tree. Oh, he's, he is, uh, I don't know what happened here. He's a little more tangled. I can't really read. There, oh, we got one. We got one foot down. We got them both down. There we go. Look at him. He's pretty, he's pretty cute. Woo. Apparently she doesn't believe in raking up her walkway. You have a whole bucket gone? Yeah. What have you been giving out over here? One whole bucket that's gone. It smells like coffee in here. I just made some coffee. Ah yes, six o'clock at night, the perfect time to get caffeinated with coffee. <laughs> Come on, get up here. Jump up. Jump up. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> 
Look at you. Uh, I don't know. I don't know how many she's got left. Look at you. You look like Garfield. Okay, now that it's dark, I can get a better shot of all this. Look at this. I mean, God bless me, I know Halloween. Am I right? Look at the ambience. My golly, look at this shot. Whew. Oh, by the way, I put something spooky in the bushes. <gasps> it's a little hobgoblin in the bushes there. He wasn't in there before. I put him in there this morning. <laughs> Are you leaving? I am leaving because I have a long drive. I've stolen all the neighborhood's pumpkins. I know. Do you want to steal actually that pumpkin right there you can have? My that one won't be rotten. Tums She's feeding her kids pumpkins. Now, do you want to? <laughs> Let's not explain what that means. Let's not explain why you're feeding your kids pumpkins and who your kids are. <laughs> Let's just have people on the internet think it's your human children. She's feeding her pigs pumpkins. It's not human children. <laughs> I've not had my dose of uh, puppies today. Well, I've seen them, but I haven't seen them enough. Girls! Oh, little put. Hi, Maddie. Sadie, girl. Come here, Joshy misses you. I haven't seen you enough today. Let me see my little monster. Sadie's a little monster dog. Look at her. Come here. Let me see what you got. Chelsea, coming in hot. Here she is. Sadie, did you go? Have you seen all the monsters out there? Have you been watching the monsters? Oh, the monsters. <laughs> Look at this. Chelsea butt. That's Chelsea butt. And there's Sadie butt. Ah! my skeleton boy uh, next year it's gonna be something different there's gonna be all new Halloween stuff in the yard here but he's gonna be moving to my sister's farm so are the jack-o-lanterns there we're gonna have all new spooks next year jack-o-lanterns are um, not not holding up too well but they're here oh boy he needs to brush his teeth. We got people, we got people coming still. Let's see, if I was a kid, trick or treating, what, did I, what would I pick? I think I'd go with the Butterfinger, but they changed the recipe of this and it kind of sucks now. Uh, the little gummy snakes are cute. The Baby Ruth is good, that's always a good, that's always a good pick. Yes? <laughs> um, next year we're going more out. I know, we actually were all out. Yeah. We gotta have more. This was the biggest year for trick or treating ever for us. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> what do you got, real things burning in these? Yeah, they're called candles, mother. Oh, but doesn't it melt these? No. no. Oh, you got candles. You can take that home. I think we're done, right? I mean, we yeah, can. Yeah, we're done. It's after seven. Yeah, so we're done. I shut my light off on my garage. Okay, well, it is currently 12 or 7 12. I can't. I can't comprehend time. 7-12, which means technically trick-or-treating is done in my neighborhood. And I don't know about you guys, but I am starving right now. And I want to go and get some food. This is very loud. McDonald's is way too busy, so we are just going to have to go inside. Ooh, leaves on the floor. Yeah, going inside was way faster. I am gonna, I'm gonna make love to this McDonald's. You guys aren't gonna watch that. It's gonna be, it's gonna be very aggressive. It's gonna be, I don't wanna go into detail, but it's gonna be beautiful and terrifying at the same time. By the way, look, look at my little skeleton boy from Bath and Body. He's got vampire blood scent. He's a little, he's a little scent infuser thing. Well, he's in the dark now, so <laughs> trust me, he's there. You, there he is. Oh, look at that. That's spooky. A little skeleton jump scare there. I got my two veggie burgers, the fries, the cookie, the anime apple pie. That's a little disturbing, but let's see. Let's see who I got. Oh, I got, ba it shows you who it is. I got Bowser. There he is. It's Bowser. He's pretty good. That's pretty good. Nice looking Bowser there. And I am celebrating by watching the Frasier Halloween episode. I don't know why, but this phone does not like filming a TV. It's got weird coloring, but 
serving grog and mead. Which one tastes most like This beer? is how I'm spending my evening now. There are five minutes left of Halloween 2024. I have a tradition where I always hold the camera too low. I have a tradition where I go out to my front steps. I enjoy the coldness. We have a little drink of something and we just say goodbye to Halloween for this year. So let's hurry up and get out on that front porch. And I think we will try this Mountain Dew Voodoo last one of the season. And next year the flavor will be different. So this really will be the last spider flavored Voodoo. I think it tastes like spiders, but I mean that in a good way. I'm terrified of, I'm terrified of spilling this hot magma. So I hope you guys have enjoyed your Halloween season this year. I know I did as well. It's always kind of a somber moment when Halloween season is over. It always leaves me wanting more. And I think that's a good thing though, you know? I don't think there's ever been a Halloween where I'm like, okay, I'm done. Uh, tomorrow, of course, I start packing everything up. But, uh, I mean, I think it's past midnight now, so... Here's to, like I said, here's to Halloween 2025. It's really fun. Um, when you're an adult and you get to hand out the candy, there's something kind of cute and fun about that because, you know, just like seeing what the kids dress up as and everything. My first trick-or-treater was Tails from Sonic. <laughs> there was also Mario and Luigi. There's like a couple Mario and Luigis. Um, there was like evil clowns. <laughs> I actually didn't know about 65% of the costumes. Uh, so I, I don't know if I'm out of touch or if what's going on there, but I, uh, like I said, I hope you guys have enjoyed joining me and my family on, on Trick or Treat Halloween 2024. I am going to blow this candle out so it doesn't burn my porch down. It's not a, well, it is a candle. It's a lantern and candle, but yeah. I'll be back with Halloween content next year. Well, I mean, I'll be back just in general, but, you know, I have a lot of big ideas for next year. Let's take one more swig of this. Look how green. I'm very green. Look at me. I'm very, very green. I'm orange, I'm green. I'm orange, I'm green. All right, here we go, one last swig. I like how I'm pretending this is like alcohol. This is, oh, I'm a man drinking alcohol. That jack-o'-lantern's gonna be in a garbage bin tomorrow morning. <laughs> he's, he's lived his life, he's had a good one. All right guys, happy Halloween.